Hello, in this tech tip, we will see how to apply materials to all the components in the assembly with the help of a map key so that the efforts to apply the materials are reduced. So to begin with, let me first enable the tree columns and I will show the model parameter column which is PTC material name. Now here we can see that all the components in the assembly they have not been assigned any material and the total number of components here are 20 so it is a time consuming process to assign the material by opening them separately in a different window so let us begin with the creation of map key for that first I will type in the word map in the command finder and I will find this map key command now in this map keys dialog box I will start with a new map key creation and I will give it a name as MA because it is material assignment then let me put some more text the name of map, map key that is material assignment and this is the description of that map key which is this map key assigns materials to all components in the assembly so after doing this first I will select this base plate part which is the first part then once this part is selected uh, we will see this record keyboard input as the prompt handling and then start record then let me right click on the part and open it in a separate window after this let us go to file prepare and model properties in the materials not assigned select change and once we are in this materials directory we can say pause for keyboard input and select pause then here I will type in a prompt like select material then say ok after that I can select this legacy materials and I will select one of the material and say assign so after assigning the material I will say resume for this map key then say ok in the materials dialog box close this model properties and then I will close this base plate part as well after doing this much I will say stop for the map key and then we can say ok so now this material assignment map key comes over here in the map keys and I can close this map keys dialog box and we can now see that for this part the steel material has been assigned now since my keyboard inputs are recorded in the map key so I can use those to assign the map keys uh, quickly for each part so suppose I select this cover.prt and then I press M and A one after other on the keyboard so the part opens and then here comes the materials directory and it is showing the materials in model cover.prt so let me again go over here in legacy materials and let me assign some different material after material assignment let us say resume so the part gets closed and it is showing the material so this is a quick methodology to assign the material again for next part I will do the same thing so again assign a different material then again say resume so in this manner I can assign the materials quickly so let me just uh, assign them for all the parts I will not show that thing because it is a uh, task of repetition let us see quickly after assignment of all those materials so now we can see that materials have been assigned to all the parts in the assembly with the help of quick map key then let us see the next method wherein we can create a map key to remove the materials from all the parts and that is very simple so I will again go to this uh, map keys menu 
and let me create a new map key I will give it a name as MR because it is material removal and again let us give it a name also the description then let me select this first part after selection let us say record keyboard input and click on this record so we'll open this part again after opening the part I will go to again file prepare and model properties so here I will go to change for the material first I will say unassign then I will also delete this material and then say ok close this also close the part and then I will stop the map key very simple thing so this MR map key has been created then let us check it first it is unassigned for the first part then for second part I will select and I will just press M and R one after other so now there is no material for second part again I will do the same thing for third part and we can see that three parts are now having no material so by this method of creation of map key we can quickly assign the material and quickly unassign the materials for all the parts in the assembly which is a big assembly consisting of more number of components thank you